Well, the sun's come out and it's the perfect day to get planting and that's exactly what this local group of students has been up to. They've been planting some native plants. So Marcus, tell us a bit about what you've been up to. Uh, we've been planting some trees at the Ronga Reserve and a group of more than this is us four, we've planted a thousand trees. A thousand trees, wow that is a lot of natives, that's surely going to help our awa and the whole ecosystem. So Hunter, it's going to be good for the environment but you were particularly interested in planting these trees, why? Um, it's good for the environment and it also helps the long-tailed bat. Ah, and we're going to find out more about the long-tailed bat, the peka peka, shortly. So, Mika, I'm really interested. A thousand plants. Where do you get all these plants from? They are locally sourced um, native trees. Excellent. And, and Tony, you're taking care of this project with these guys. Help them out. Why is it so important to have locally sourced plants? So that they uh, suit the environment around here, the same native forest that we have here. So they're all locally eco-sourced seeds that they collect and grow in the nurseries. And then we plant them back in the ground, don't we? Yeah. Fantastic. And Anna, can you just let these plants be or do you have to work at, at keeping them living and surviving over a period of time? Well, you have to weed them so they can live. Yeah, and that's important work rather than just letting them be. They might get choked with weeds otherwise. Well, well done guys. Really important work that you're doing. We'll let you get on with it and plant some more natives today. Well done. Well done guys. Great mahi. Thanks.